Hey guys, what's going on? Wayne here. So look, the brand formerly known as Doosan has made its very first machine introduction since the announcement of its name change to Devalon a couple of weeks back at World of Concrete. Um, but anyway, we got our first look here at Iron Pros at this new excavator at the ARA Show 2023 in Orlando. During that show, the newly named Devalon introduced the DX89R-7. Now this machine is intended to replace the DX85R-7 and overall it's a stronger machine that's really designed to better bridge the gap between Devalon's compact excavator category and its medium sized uh, crawler excavator category. So you might have looked at this machine and you said, okay, they've changed their name to Devalon. Why does this excavator still have a Doosan badge on it? Well, um, basically the initiative to kind of change over the branding and the name of uh, Doosan to Devalon, it hasn't begun in earnest yet. We're expecting that to really start after Con Expo 2023 here that's coming up in about a month. Now at World of Concrete, uh, we mentioned earlier is when Doosan announced its name change to Devalon. Devalon is a play on words, kind of a pun meant to evoke the idea of developing onward, developing machines for the future of the construction industry. In terms of the kind of brand changeover, uh, we're gonna learn more details about the Devalon brand in terms of the brand identity, the type of things that they're going to be focusing on in the future, how the company is going to kind of change under the new uh, parentage of Hyundai, because Hyundai, if you'll remember, is the company that bought Doosan Infracore North America. They basically split that business, which it used to include Bobcat. Bobcat is still owned by Doosan, whereas Doosan Infracore was sold to Hyundai, and now they're getting rid of the Doosan name in favor of Devalon. But anyway, we're gonna learn a lot more about the Devalon kind of brand at Con Expo. There may be even some kind of like changes to the scheme of paint. I think they're keeping the orange and black colors, but the way that those colors are used on machines in the future, probably gonna change. They're gonna announce new machines at that show, discuss more about the brands. Long story short, on this machine in particular and any other kind of Doosan branded machine you might buy before the middle of this year, you're probably gonna get a Doosan badged machine. All right, but let's talk about this machine itself, the DX89R-7. In general, the 89R-7 really kind of carries over much of what made the DX85R-3 a successful machine. But again, they're really trying to make this more of a bridge machine. So some of it, the, uh, probably like the undercarriage, a lot of the drive, uh, hydraulics, all of that is kind of carried over. But what they have increased is they're trying to make this a stronger machine. Uh, lifting performance, operating weight, all of those things have seen boosts. Oh, and they, uh, they also added horsepower. Now this is a nine metric ton excavator, so it really does put it right there at the upper end of the compact excavator lineup at Devalon. Uh, and your next step up will be a medium sized excavator uh, in the full sized lineup. It is a reduced tail swing design as well. And it combines that reduced tail swing design with the boom swing feature. Now the boom swing feature is really easily activated. It's got, there's a thumb switch on the left joystick that allows you to uh, turn boom swing on and off. And when you combine that boom swing with the reduced tail swing, obviously you're going to be able to get this machine, which is still pretty powerful, into some tight spaces. Now we mentioned that extra horsepower earlier. This machine is powered by a D24 diesel engine from Devalon, and it provides 65 horsepower to the machine. Now in terms of specs, the machine has a maximum dig depth of 13 feet 6 inches and a maximum digging reach of 22 feet 6 inches. Now maximum load height on the 89R-7 is 15 feet 5 inches. But if you do need a little bit more reach on this machine, Devalon is making a long arm option available and that's going to add about 2 feet to your maximum dig depth and to your max reach. This is designed as a bridge excavator. Yes, it has the reduced tail swing. Yes, it has the boom swing, but it also adds power. So in the end, this machine is really designed for people who need as much power as you can get out of a compact excavator, but still need to put that machine into tight spaces. To that end, Devalon has increased the operating weight on the DX89R-7 over its predecessor. This machine now weighs in at 21,000 and five pounds. That's definitely gonna help in your stability and, and lifting uh, heavier loads. However, they've also increased the counterweight to add even more stability and power. So that increase to the counterweight, the increase to the operating weight, you are gonna be able to lift more with this machine than you were with the DX85R-3. Now in the end, this increased weight, this increased power, this increased counterweight, it's gonna make operators' lives a lot easier in specific applications, right? Where you would need to get a, a machine into a tight space while also needing to be able to lift 
a lot, including utility work where if you're lifting pipes or other materials into trenches and you're doing a lot of backfilling, but also uh, landscapers or hardscapers who are going to be uh, lifting, you know, heavier loads in those confined spaces such as, you know, boulders and other hardscape materials. Now getting back to backfilling because the weight of this machine has increased, Devlon has also increased the tractive force on this machine. And with that increase in tractive force, you know, pushing through materials with the dozer blade, backfilling, all of that's going to get a lot easier. Now, another kind of uh, feature that is really aimed at making backfilling and dozing easier is blade float. Blade float kind of automatically, you turn it on and it automatically raises and lowers the height of the blade so you don't have to. Now, obviously, attachments have greatly augmented, complemented the compact excavator category. It's just one of the things that makes this machine category so attractive at the cost, right? of using backhoes in, in similar situations. Uh, more and more, we're needing to get these machines into smaller spaces without a compromise to power and without a compromise to what we can do with that machine, right? So a lot of the, uh, the new attachments out there, whether it's hammers or compactors or tilt rotators, all of those things are extremely important whenever you're purchasing a new compact excavator. And Devalon has kept that in mind. And one of the uh, big kind of additions to this machine is piping for a quick coupler. So a, not a quick coupler itself, but you do have the piping as a standard feature on this machine. If you want to add a quick coupler so that from the cab, you can you know quickly couple and switch between attachments on the job site. Now, Devalon has specifically called out some particularly good matches for the 80 R-7 in terms of attachments you can use it with. This machine is a particularly good match for augers, breakers, grapples, rippers, and plate compactors. And on the attachment front, one more thing that you need to be aware of is if you want to use a multi-function attachment with this machine, such as a tilt rotator, the tilt rotator is becoming a more and more popular attachment to put on these machines, you can opt for a second set of hydraulics to run those multi uh, function attachments. Now the DX89R-7 also represents the introduction of some new comfort and cab focus features that are really aimed at operators. The first among those is improvements to the vents throughout the, the cab of this machine to improve the performance of air conditioning. There's also an eight inch uh, touchscreen display that is standard on this machine that will give you the view from the rear view camera. An all around view 360 degree view monitoring system of cameras is also available and it's gonna show up on that touchscreen um, as well. An LED lighting package is an available option as well. And one of the standard features on this machine that's a nice little uh, kind of operator comfort uh, focus thing is fold up pedals. You can fold the pedals up and out of the way whenever you need more floor space. Oh, one more thing, Bluetooth audio is standard on this as well so that you can connect your phone, listen to your music, take phone calls. And the maintenance story on this, pretty much what you would expect from a modern compact excavator. Devalon has done a really good job at keeping everything you want within easy reach within reach. So the engine and the pump package, the valve bank, the cooling system, the hydraulic system, there's easy access to all of those things inside the machine. Uh, your filters, your fluids, your air cleaner, uh, battery, and all your other everyday kind of maintenance checks, they're all right there. The access to that is, has actually been improved on the 89 as compared to the 85 that it replaces. A couple of other nice features that really make maintenance this machine a lot easier. There is a battery disconnect switch. There is a centralized grease bank. And and all of the wiring and hydraulic hoses have been color coded and labeled. Well, all right guys, that's gonna wrap it up for our preview look, our first look at the Debalon DX89R-7. Unfortunately, we don't have any kind of working footage of the machine at this time, but as of right now, um, this is what we know in terms of like a first look and uh, a preview. We might learn a little bit more about this machine at Con Expo 2023, so stay tuned for that. Devalon is definitely a company to kind of keep an eye on right now. After that purchase from Hyundai, they will be competing with Hyundai. They are going to be considered competitors. The Hyundai construction equipment brand and Devalon are going to be competing for market share there. But Devalon was kind of already kind of branching out even before this. they announced uh, development of two dozers that are, that are in development. Hopefully we'll learn more about those machines and some of the other product introductions at Con Expo 2023, so be sure to stay tuned. And thanks for watching this video. And uh, leave us a comment below. We always love hearing from you guys. And uh, otherwise, we'll, we'll see you in the next one. Take it easy.